Always fresh every day. You're watching Fast Lane Daily. Bugatti Green Light's a new model, and no, it's not another special edition Veyron. Also, there could be a Super Godzilla Nissan GTR in the works, and some California Skyline owners have their rides taken by the U.S. Attorney General. All that plus comment of the week and a music video from your friend and mine, Bob Schumann Jr. Yes, a music video. What up, everybody? I'm Derek D. You're checking out Fast Lane Daily on a Friday. Uh, Friday. It's the weekend. Woo! Fast Lane Daily with Derek D. Always fresh every day. Have an extra, say, 1.5 mil laying around? Sure, everyone does. So if you do, Bugatti's got your fix. The eccentric manufacturer has given the Galibier concept the green light. After wowing a potential client base after a few showings, Reports indicate that Bugatti is feeling pretty confident about the Galibier's future. If the pictures don't jar your memory, let me give you the rundown. The Galibier features an 8-liter W16 motor producing 800 horsepower by way of a two-stage supercharger, an 8-speed automatic, an active suspension system, more polished aluminum and carbon fiber than an airplane, and plenty of electronic driving aids to ensure you do not put the $1.5 million car into a wall. That would be bad. Although there's not been an official confirmation from Bugatti, it is assumed that production will begin by early 2010. So if you're thinking about buying that island in the Caribbean, hold off a bit and put that loot towards something more useful, like the Galibier. And if high-end luxury isn't your thing, then the obvious place for you is with the geeks over at Nissan. Yep, these guys. They seem to have been working up a storm for the past few months. Phew, I was worried. There hasn't been a new version of the Nissan GTR in like four days. Right, guys? All right. Well, now we can relax because Nissan is almost ready to release their newly prepped Nissan GTR, rumored to be dubbed the Spec M. The guys over at Piston Heads took a visit to the Nissan testing grounds and learned a few little secrets about the next generation GTR. But now they're out in the wild and Godzilla is pissed. Supposedly, suspension will be made stiffer for the next refresh, as well as new rear diffusers intakes and ducts. Also, a new data system with PC interface by Nismo will be included. Very cool stuff for the future Godzilla, or should I say, Super Godzilla. We don't have more specifics, but maybe we'll see more in Tokyo or at the LA Auto Show. Speaking of which, we'll be there. And talking about Godzilla, the feds are cracking down on the illegally imported Nissan Skyline GTRs in California. Car enthusiasts who have wanted to own cars in the United States that were never officially sold here have come up with creative solutions on how to get the cars into the country. One way that has worked is ship the engine separate from the rest of the car into the country. When arriving, you mend all the parts and pieces back together and then register it as a legal kit car. Well, the U.S. Attorney General has caught on and wants the shenanigans to stop. So far, two R34 GTRs and an R32 have been seized from owners who have spent hundreds of thousands of dollars getting their, quote, kit cars here to the United States. In a letter from the Department of Justice to owners, the U.S. Attorney General states that these cars do not comply to EPA standards, and thus the government has the right to seize and impound such vehicles. Now these owners will have to spend thousands of dollars in legal fees to get their rightfully owned cars back just to be told they can never drive them again. Fail. Next up, Commenter of the Week and a little Bob Schumann music video. That's all after this. Subscribing costs nothing. Daily, not monthly. And our cars actually move. Fastlane Daily is fast and fresh and here to stay. Welcome back. Do you guys know what time it is? Today it's headline. No. no, it's comment. Just roll the song. Comments. All right. This week's comment is in regard to the Ferrari 458 Italia and the video we showed earlier this week. Well, maybe not so much about the car, but the word Ferrari. The Tominator 2. Tominator, huh? Very clever. Well, he said, did you know that Ferrari actually translates as Smith? And Smith is actually the most common slash second most common surname in almost every country. Okay, at first I was like, hmm, come on, dude. You're totally just making that up to sound cool and act like you know something that other people don't. But then I looked it up and found that Ferrari actually means an occupational surname 
from the Italian word ferraro, meaning blacksmith, originally derived from the Latin ferrum, meaning iron, the Italian equivalent of the surname Smith. So yeah, Ferrari actually means Smith, it's true. But since the name Smith is so common as seeing a friggin' Honda Civic, and let's be honest, Ferraris are generally not that common to see, I'm sure we'll get a few people saying like, oh, I see Ferraris like every day, I'm cool, my dad has one, blah, 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 we get it. But I don't want, I don't want Ferrari meaning Smith. No offense to you people with the last name Smith, but I want Ferrari to mean like, glorious roller of the roads, or enchanted cloud maneuver, or like unicorn, not Smith. So Ferrari, unless you start making cars for us middle class folk who have the name Smith, how about you just go ahead and start saying Ferrari means unicorn? Just sounds better. I'm sorry, Smiths. But anyway, keep those comments flowing, because we read them, and of course, we rock them. All right, you'll be getting a shirt, my friend. Well, that about does it for Fast Lane Daily today, but first, my boy, Bob Shubin. Bob Shubin Jr.'s got a music video, and uh, I think we should just roll it. Uh, hey, how about a deal? A deal? Hey, how about a deal with me? Bob Shubin Jr., the best car dealer in the world. Promise you won't get low-balled, and if you do, I'll have a few guys called. Hey, how about a deal with me? Bob Shubin Jr., the best car dealer in the world. I won't do you wrong. Do you think I sit down and write this whole song? Bob Shubin is my name. Hey! Selling calls is my game, and I'll give you the best deal. I swear you won't find a guy like me anywhere when I was just a young guy. Did some deals I didn't like, like that time when I sold a bike to a black kid whose name was Mike. I told him it would make him see. Then he rolled right into a tree, and he died, and I felt so bad. Not to mention my dad was mad. You think I would have learned my lesson? But I did it, started selling cars. Ripping off people was such a thrill. I swear I could have sold a whore to Dr. Phil, but now I've changed my ways. Those days are behind me. I am an honest man, and I will not steal. Give you a solid deal, and I'll help you never get ripped off again. Hey, how you doing? I swear, I'm Bob Schubert, senior's life, that I am a changed man, now I am honest about it. And this song is dedicated to that blind kid, Mikey, although I'm still stuck to the fact I told him to turn left. Let's go! Hey, how about a deal with me? Bob Schubert Jr., the best car dealer in the world. I'll show you the best way to spend it. If you need help, I'm looking at you, GM. Hey, how about a deal with me? Bob Schubert Jr., the best car dealer in the world. The guy that you can trust in blackjack. I'll show you how not to bust. I'm serious, we'll go to AC, I love Blackjack Cap about it. This kind of sounds like Sesame Street, I love that show. All right, let's bring it home, sing it. Hey, how about a deal? Hey, how about a deal? Hey, how about a deal with me? Bob Super Jr., the best cop dealer in the world. And if you need some advice, I'll give it to you. At a decent price, I said, hey, have a deal with me. Bob Schubert Jr., the best cop dealer in the world. And I'll let you take the wheel in my 77 Cadillac DeVille. Hey, you better deal with me. I'm Bobby Schubert, bang, bing, bang, bang, Schubert Jr., how you doing? How about it? All right. Clap it up for Bob Schubert. That was good. It was catchy. If you guys want to see that video in HD, Head over to facebook.com slash fastlanedaily or just click the annotation on my face right here. All right. See you, everybody. Have a great weekend. Woo! Bob Shubert Jr., yes! Hey, I'm out of deal. Hey, I mean, hey, I'm the have out of deal.